There is a thing in me that dreamed of trees. A quiet house, some green and modest acres, a little way from every troubling town, a little way from factories, schools, laments. I would have time, I thought, and time to spare, with only streams and birds for company, to build out of my life a few wild stanzas. There is a thing in me still dreams of trees, but let it go, homesick for moderation. Half the world's artists shrink or fall away. If any fine solution, let him tell it. Meanwhile, I bend my heart toward lamentation, where, as the times implore, our true involvement, the blades of every crisis point the way. I would it were not so, but it is whoever made music of a mild day. It kind of completes a question I was coming to an end with, where you really can't escape, even as an artist feeling that level of connection with vibrations of other people, with the earth, with nature in general. There's no escape as far as um, finding a loophole in society where you can just be okay. If you're open to vibrations and people greater than yourself and outside yourself. So it's, it's the only place you really can escape is on the canvas or on whatever that medium may be. went on your website and one of your paintings is called State of Blue and I just like the title so much and I just thought that was such a good framework for this show and for us to explore all the meanings of State of Blue. Penn State, Blue and White, and then on a deeper level just all the layers of meaning to State of Blue. I think you and I and our artwork together um, because your artwork is so emotionally raw, so powerful, and you have that urban grittiness to your artwork. And I'm more, we're both abstract, but I think I'm more pastoral, more in the woods, more of a natural kind of flow. And I think. I would add energy to yours as well. And I think the two, I'm just so excited to work with you because I think the two energies together, I think it'll come together for a really good show. So um, I'm so excited. Again, this Blue White weekend, um, I'm working on about 10 or 12 new pieces and I have a whole new technique that I really love and that will be my main focus of the exhibit. So it will be a lot of different artwork that I've shown in the last two years and it's a lot of texture and it's a whole different uh, way that I'm painting in a whole different direction that I'm going in. So I think my 10 or 12 paintings and then what you're working on. Um, as far as what I'm working on, I'll uh, release uh, probably another seven pieces into the State of Blue series itself. Mm -hmm. And uh, there's also a couple of pieces within the block me and different things that uh, interject uh, the different styles uh, as far as um, some that's more street art, some that's more athletic, and overall it's going to be an abstract cover. So um, there'll be a balance from uh, a couple of new pieces, all original artworks, and uh, I'm looking forward to just how that'll blend in and just curating that level of energy with your new pieces and your new style. So to be able to resonate with Penn Staters in an abstract format, and even to have that level of networking. This coming show, State of Blue. State of Blue 2017. Yeah, be there. Definitely.